Depend on News Channel 9 and Bell South Mobility for up to the minute weather forecasts. Bell South Mobility customers can access the Bell South Mobility News Channel 9 weather line free of charge by dialing star 9. Another way you can depend on us. At News Channel 9, we know learning never takes a vacation. That's why we're gearing up for the News Channel 9 Science Theater Summer Program. Director Ben Roy, an educator for over 27 years, has brand new shows and special events this summer, including Space Invaders for pre-kindergarten through first graders, The Science Detectives for second, third, and fourth graders, and Shockwaves designed to appeal to children from fifth to eighth grade. We welcome all daycare and scout groups. Don't miss the special events planned for summer, from the moon rock display and adventures in space show to a wildlife program. Ben Roy brings science alive to children all across the Tennessee Valley. The summer program runs from June 8th to July 31st and is a perfect activity for both civic and church groups. Keep young minds fresh and ready to go for school next year with Ben Roy's exciting summer science adventures at the News Channel 9 Science Theater. Reservations are necessary. Call 875-8522 today. News Channel 9. 40 years of your best memories. At News Channel 9, we really do hear you. Your opinions help us serve you better. Here are some comments about recent Storm Track 9 weather coverage. Fast storm alerts. News Channel 9 knew exactly what was happening. Neil makes us more secure knowing what's coming next. Very informative. Excellent coverage. We hear you, our viewers. And that's why we're producing a Storm Track 9 severe weather tape to help protect you and your family. To order, send $9.95 plus $2 shipping and handling to Storm Track 9 Severe Weather Tape, P.O. Box 1150, Chattanooga. Please allow four to six weeks for delivery. Credit card orders, call 875-8522. We can't prevent dangerous weather, but we can protect ourselves and our families with the most accurate weather information. Depend on us. Wheel of Fortune, tonight at 7 on News Channel 9. Now, live from WTBC Chattanooga, this is News Channel 9 at 5.30. Well, there are Beanie Babies on it. It tells you which Beanie Babies there are, and, like the prices, like the reduced. Beanie Babies are one craze, but then so is the Internet. The online madness has always been on. <laughs> Good afternoon, I'm Calvin Snoop. And I'm Felicia McGee. Most of us have a telephone and a television and all that stuff in our homes, but another high-tech device is gaining popularity, a computer. And it's stuffed with a lot of stuff, too. Here are the facts on that. According to a recent survey, 50% of you have a home computer, or a PC as they call them. Another 19% of you plan to have a PC by the year 2000. And a lot of people go online with the help of a computer. People are surfing the internet for a lot of reasons. Now, some do it for educational purposes, while others are, shall we say, just enjoying the waves. But today, we decided to find out what are your favorite websites. This is the face of news. Intense. Touching. Human. Real. This is the face of news, and this is the news team that captures the facts, refines the details, and brings it home to you. This is the face of News Channel 9, the one you can depend on for live, local, and late-breaking news. Weeknights at 5, 5.30, 6, and 11. The next time you think about the good old days, remember, we were there too. News Channel 9. 40 years of your best memories. Country music phenomenon Leanne Rhymes will be at this year's Riverbend Festival, and so could you. News Channel 9, US 101, and Philo are giving away five VIP packages to see her show. Each package includes 100 tokens, four box seats, and four Riverbend pins. Winners will be announced each night June 8th to June 12th during News Channel 9 at 5.30. You must be at least 18 to win, so take your bus card to your closest Philo customer service desk and depend on News Channel 9 and US 101 for your Riverbend information. ABC Tonight is the most daring night of comedy on television because we boldly go... Go put on something with snaps or Velcro. We got work to do. Where no comedy...
realities have gone before. Oh, I just checked out my mother! And? And she's a smoking hottie! Spin City and Dharma and Greg, the final frontier of comedy. Tonight on News Channel 9. Jeopardy! Tonight at 7.30 on News Channel 9. Now, live from WTBC Chattanooga, this is News Channel 9 at 6. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. Detectives say a Rossville, Georgia trio cranked out more than $4,000 worth of phony $20 bills. And then they tried to spend some of those bogus bills in Chattanooga and North Georgia, but they got caught red-handed. John Madewell joins us from one of the stores, uh, one store on the paper trail. John? Bob Deb, detectives say a Chattanooga man not connected but holding one of the $20 bills that they say the ring produced tried to spend it here at this Amico convenience store. Now this is a real $20 bill and detectives and clerks say the counterfeits look nothing like it and are really bad fakes. Welcome to News Channel 9 on the Internet. Surfing the net is quickly becoming one of America's favorite pastimes. News Channel 9's cyberspace home is at newschannel9.com. Here you can find out more about News Channel 9 at ABC. You can surf through medical news, consumer information, or get the inside scoop on the News Channel 9 news team. Plus, we'll update you on breaking news and weather forecasts coming up on News Channel 9. Just go to newschannel9.com. It's just one more way you can depend on us. Watching News Channel 9, WTVC Chattanooga, with Bob Johnson, Mary Ellen Loker, Storm Track 9 Chief Meteorologist Neil Pasco, and Daryl Patterson Sports. This is News Channel 9 at 6. News Channel 9's online at Etowah Middle School with our neighborhood storm track network. From this school and others across the Tennessee Valley, we can tell you weather from your back door. News Channel 9 would like to thank Etowah Utilities and the Etowah Parent Teacher Student Organization for sponsoring the program. And of course, thanks to underwriting sponsors Memorial Hospital and Synthetic Industries. News Channel 9 can now report up to the minute weather conditions live from McMinn County. Local businesses, schools, and News Channel 9 working together to improve our schools. Depend on us. Neil Pascal's forecast is approved by the American Meteorological Society. Well, we don't want anybody splitting any hairs with us, so we got to tell you that our temperature for downtown Chattanooga, is, or what do we go by, the airport's temperature or downtown at the studio? Well, officially, we should, for keeping records, we should go to the airport's temperature. Okay. But let's check, let's put that up right now on the screen, would you all? Let's see what we have downtown. It's so going to have our site up. If you all would put up that, it's 94, but look at that. We've been 97 downtown. The so record's 96. we broke a record downtown. That's right. You know, it's hot is hot. <laughs> <laughs> it's just hot. Oh, goodness. Yeah, it feels like 102. The pressure's real low, though. That means something's going on. So let me show you the tomorrow's forecast. I'll tell you what's going on right now. I think we're going to see some thunderstorms before much longer. Uh, things seem to be ripening for them. They're going to be getting closer. Could even see them here in the morning. But a pretty good chance tomorrow, and not quite so hot either with more clouds, probably ending up around 88 or so for the high. All right, let's get in next to some more temperatures around the region. And, of course, if you want to compare apples with oranges, uh, since that's where the record was broken years ago in 1936 at the airport, that's where you'd have to actually break it today to set a new record. You can't take another site and apply it to them. But the airport so far has been 95, so that's close. Yesterday was equally as close. And if, uh, one more thing to clear up here. That's Etowah City School. We know that, not Etowah Middle School. 89 Crossville, 92 Nashville, 90 Huntsville. It's, it's hot all over the place. Look at the radar. You'll see the storms working across Kentucky there, west to east. Tornado watch out for folks around Knoxville, up into Virginia, way over there in North Carolina. Not Murphy, though. And those storms will continue working like so as this front that's to our north, it's a strong one for this time of year, continues a southward push, then that's going to take the conditions causing those storms and put them over us, especially by tomorrow, maybe even Friday. I don't mean necessarily we're going to see tornadoes here, no, but we could be put under some sort of severe weather watch a couple times tomorrow, uh, for instance, possibly even toward morning. That would be about the, as early as I see anything coming here. Nothing imminent heading our way at all, but this front, even though it's labeled stationary, is expected with a shove of Canadian high pressure to very, very slowly move southward, and it's going to cause quite a conflict around here because it's a hot 
Partly cloudy tonight, late chance of a shower or storm toward morning, low 72, so warm. Tomorrow, it's likely we're going to see showers and storms around 70% chance. Some of the storms strong and heavy, 88 the high. Tomorrow night, 70th, the storms probably will weaken later tomorrow night, but Friday we could see a regeneration of some showers and storms. And look how much cooler it's going to get by the weekend, the way things look here. What a change that's going to be. Let's hope we get some rain, though. Yeah, in the meantime, we do need some rain. Thanks. Okay.